that? What's he waiting for? I'm begging him to eat him, lad. Eat him. Give him a chance. He'll get there. <laughs> Come on, fight me. So what? Why should I? You're not even worth it. See, that's all you can do, innit? Intimidate people. Come on. If it makes you feel better, I'm studying. I ain't going anywhere. But have a look in your corner, Jason. Who's in there who gives a toss about you, eh? Make sure you don't have to bully to be here. Your wife, your kids, where are they, eh? Well, I'll tell you where they are. They've left you, haven't they? They've all left you. You don't know anything about me. <laughs> I know you're a loser. That's why people run a mile, innit? So you do is hurt people. Look at you. You find a weak spot and you push and you push and push until they break. So come on, then. What happened to you? So you're so messed up, eh? Did Daddy not understand you? <laughs> that got you, didn't it, eh? Truth hurts, doesn't it? So do something about it. Stop pushing people away. And I'll eventually have people who actually care about it. Oh, Harry! What are you doing? Get your guard up! Oh, God. Oh, yeah. That's the real Jason, isn't it? That's the Jason everybody hates. Do you know what, mate? I don't hate you, mate. I just pity you. And where do you think you're going? It's over, mate. We're done. Get back in here. Now! <laughs> so, how did it go? Did everyone go through with the fight? Well, he stood there, faced Jason, and walked away. What, seriously? Well, why didn't you text me? Because I've been worried, Ticky. Yeah, well, don't be, because I really think it might be over. Hey. Oh, what's up? Have you been crying? Thanks. It's Dad. Look on Jason's face when you talk into him like that. <laughs> Mate, I thought he was going to burst into tears. Must have felt good. Yeah, I guess. Hey, proud of you, though. Could have got messy, that. Oh, um, I don't believe it. It's Jason, he's wasted. Get out of here and finish what you started, you coward! That's it, now I'm calling the police. No, no, leave it, leave it. What? I can't believe it. Look at him, man, he's off his face. Are you listening, Nancy boy? Oh, what are you doing? What do you think I'm doing? I'm letting him in. Sorry. I know I'm probably overreacting. I'm emotional at the best of times these days. I'm the one who should be apologising. I know Lawrence hasn't been himself lately. I, sh I should be helping more. No, you've done so much already. Probably wouldn't still have a business if it wasn't for you. Is he not any better after the aneurysm? Well, that's just it. I don't know. He says he's fine, that he's only having the odd nightcap, but... It's more than well, that. he has been under a lot of stress lately, with Ronnie leaving, and then there's Chrissy and Lachlan moving out. He's bound to be low. So much so that he doesn't care about the business? Things are getting worse every day. We've we'll discussed this. Talk to a solicitor. Talk to a doctor, more like. He's obviously still poorly. Oh, you're right. I should take him back to the hospital, see if they can run some tests. Whoa, whoa, whoa. you can't just walk in there unannounced. I mean, I know you're worried, but let's take this one step at a time, shall we? I've got to do something before he gets any worse. OK, OK, well, why don't I come back with you, see if I can talk to him about his drinking? Oh, like Lawrence is going to listen to you. Well, it's got to be worth a try. I mean, you know what he's like? If you try and force the issue, then it might make things worse. OK. Yeah, if you think so. But if that doesn't work, then I'm getting him to a doctor, no matter what. 